Shalom, my name is Joshua Yaakov, and this is being made from Jerusalem. Congratulations to the Obama campaign headquarters. Very impressive. Uh, specifically, uh, David Axelrod, uh, David Palouf, uh, John Thoreau, and Adam Frankel, the speechwriters. Um, uh, my name is again Joshua Yaakov. I live in Jerusalem. I'm an American citizen. I've lived here for 22 years. I'm a didactic scientist. And the author of Humanomics, uh, that's the trilogy, uh, comprised of two paradigms, the new cognitive science and behavioral, uh, cognitive science, behavioral paradigm, and the new economic paradigm. The latter is going to be the central issue of winning the uh, White House, aside from the tremendous and impressive, iconic um, um, rallies, massive crowds, tremendous fundraising, online organization, campaign organization. It's very, very impressive. Aleph the Tov. But um, uh, must come to something. One more thing has to be added to your campaign to make it a winner. And that's the purpose of this video. And it is called content. In fact, it's international content. Humanomics in general and the new economic paradigm in particular has to become the Democratic National Committee's DNC's uh, platform for the presidential campaign for Barack. That's uh, number one. Number two, it should be what President Obama seeks as the uh, as a mandate from the Congress to make a world class and to build, develop, and acculturate a world class global technological infrastructure. Why? Because it will uh, retool, retrain, and reeducate the entire U.S. workforce over the next uh, several decades, and that's involving three or four generations uh, significantly in that time span. Uh, having said that, uh, it will require a four to five trillion dollar investment. Uh, I own the science and intellectual property. Uh, if I were to take that into a public vehicle and try to uh, persuade the institutions of the capital markets of the world to make another uh, IBM Microsoft vehicle, I'm told by uh, uh, Warren Buffett and others, uh, Gates, experts, people who know what they're talking about, that the new economic paradigm, uh, its business and technology model, is uh, w estimated to be worth between 50 and 100 billion in its first phase, and perhaps double or triple that in its second and third phases of development. I own it. Okay, more importantly, uh, I live in Jerusalem for 22 years very modestly. And I'm a world-class didactic scientist. I have no intent, interest or interest in going to the capital markets. There is another way to do it. I'm going to authorize a public trust and put this intellectual property in a public trust so that the workers in America own it. And we're going to ask the Congress of the United States to fund uh, the development. 60% of the development of the new world-class global technological infrastructure will come from the G9 partnering. Uh, it'll be amortized over 20 years, and what's the end result? It will create tens of millions of jobs. This is what's mission. In this articulation, uh, David, uh, John, and Adam. This is missing from the speeches. It's got to be. We've got to find a way to incorporate, raise the, raise the bar, raise the level. Uh, Barak's plan and program is the new economic paradigm. It's not an articulation that's based upon world-class science. It's the integration of labor. It identifies information. You don't have to go into explaining the, the technical stuff. By the way, the trilogy, Humanomics, is 2,500 pages in its fifth draft. Uh, it'll be published sometime in the next uh, 18 months on the web with a few hundred graphics when the lawyers approve uh, uh, this. Uh, but having said that, you know, I'm 65. I'm not, I'm not one of you, uh, one of your 20 or 30 year old staff members. I look at the, the you know, I, my, my, gr my <laughs> I have a couple of, for 65, I, I have a seven year old and a four year old, and their older brother is 45, uh, 46, and 44, their sister in America, which is th my, my son and daughter in America are old enough to be most of the staff's father. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I'm still young. Okay, look, uh, let's come to talk this. Uh, it's very, very important that uh, that uh, David uh, David Axelrod is the is the strategist. He's the uh, he's the he's the he's the guy who looks out over the horizon. David um, and uh, uh, and David Pal Palouf, if I hope I say I'm saying that correct. Uh, you guys, come on, let's get the new economic paradigm on 
on the radar, folks. By the way, there's 15 million people who've already voted on the on the on the web with it on the on the, on the in the uh, branding phase. And right now we're uh, we're making a uh, uh, plans for a video blog and another uh, a portal and a lot of things to brand humanomics. Uh, uh, and uh, we will use some of the techniques even that the uh, the Obama campaign have used uh, in the world. But, but I'm 65. I, I have no. <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea to uh, to make uh, icons out of 65 year old men. So I think we're going to make an icon out of the content. So let's make that the new economic paradigm, and let's put that icon in Barack Obama's wallet uh, to take to the bank. This is what he can cash in the votes to win the White House with. And and the, the certainty of it will it'll put it'll put McCain on the back foot. Now I am not uh, selling the local potatoes here. This is already established. So think strategically. Think in terms of the new uh, of, of humanomics in general and the new economic paradigm. And I want to say something very significant. Uh, Barack uh, is is highly probable to be the next president of the United States, the leader of the free world. There's something that he and Michelle don't know. And David, you don't know, and you should, and it's vital. And that is that uh, I'm a didactic scientist. I observed 20 years of the collapse of the local reality, which is the end of man and mankind's exile. That is changing everything, folks. The Soviet Union collapsed, Yugoslav communism collapsed. Those were the local realities in those countries that collapsed. Zionism collapsed with the murder of uh, Yitzhak Rabin, and uh, the Ba'athist uh, regime collapsed with... And then there's uh, five or six other countries, and uh, more, 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 much more to come. I'm the guy who uh, observed that and explained what it means. Now, it's a local call here. We're very close to God. <laughs> we get a lot of help. <laughs> uh, but it is very important that uh, uh, Barak and Michelle learn, know about humanomics, which is the East-West convergence model, because the collapse of the local reality means the collapse of the East-West models. Even capitalism is imploding right now. And the net result is the convergence in the middle, which is humanomics. And humanomics is the post-collapse uh, east-west convergence model. And it's comprised, again, of two paradigms, receive it to give and the integration of labor, the latter being the new economic paradigm. The new economic paradigm is going to transform uh, the U.S. economy fundamentally and structurally. It'll take America from a from a 14 trillion to a 45 to 50 trillion, a tripling. It'll triple the purchasing power of the currency in the same 18 to 20 year period of time. It will eliminate the national debt, it'll eliminate the, the social security deficit, it'll eliminate the trade deficit. It's a win-win situation. It'll partner. It'll raise up the LDCs. It's a, it's, it's a, it's. But here is the significant. It's going to, it's going to put into trust. I am putting into the trust the intellectual property for the uh, the workers. Uh, and uh, and and they will there will be a redistribution through that as we move from 14 trillion to 45 to 50 trillion instead of it being 80 20 or 70 30 with institutions in Wall Street as opposed to the workers it's going to go the other way and that's it, uh, it the, there's going to be a distribution that is just what are we talking about we're talking about delivery of democracy a more perfect union we're going to perfect the union and stop ending the exploitation of America you got the articulation right now you've got to you've got to into you've got to bring into the mainstream of your speech your articulation the vision that is based upon world class science and international content that's humanomics in general the new economic paradigm in particular thank you for listening uh, this is what this old man is uh, is uh, is advocating and saying uh, this is important and uh, this isn't going to change and tomorrow it's going to become more and more clear and more and more clear so that's who I am, that's what I am, that's what I do, that's my purpose, uh, to deliver that. And that's what my legacy is to leave behind. Not, uh, you know, uh, I, I don't need to be another Warren Buffett. Uh, there's things far more important than that to, to all of us. Um, we love you, all of you. You're doing a fabulous job, the Obama team, you're spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> and from Jerusalem, we wish you the blessing of Kabel Bishfilatet, that's Hebrew for receive it to give. Uh, thank you for listening. I'm Yeshua Yaakov.